Hi, my name is Tom Halen. Have you ever wondered if a cheap Chinese Arduino clone will actually work? You only pay a few bucks for the same product. Seems too good to be true, right? The truth is that some work and some won't. Follow the rest of this tutorial and I'll explain you how to make them all work in no time. I use an Arduino Uno for this example, but it is the same process for most Arduino models. So here we have a genuine Arduino Uno and here's a Chinese clone. Let's do the test. My Arduino environment has been installed and is working properly. First I plug in the genuine Arduino and everything works just fine. Now I use my cheap Chinese copy and the computer does not recognize the hardware. The problem is that the clone does not use the standard serial to USB ship, but a ship marked CH340. Your computer will not recognize these CH340 chips on your computer. To fix this is very easy. Download the manufacturer software and install it on your computer. This software will work for all versions of Windows. I'll leave you a link below this video. I'll also leave a link for the Mac lovers. Now plug in your Chinese clone and try again. It should work just fine. The board should be visible now in the Arduino IDE and ready to use. I upload the blink sketch to the board and it all works fine. Though in some cases the board might still not work. This is because there is no bootloader installed on the Atmel microcontroller chip. To solve this problem we need a working Arduino and the clone Arduino we want to fix. First we connect the Arduino to our computer and open the Arduino IDE. We go to File, Examples and click on Arduino ISP and upload this to the Arduino. Once uploaded, disconnect the Arduino. Next we connect the wires from the working Arduino to the clone as follows. Pin 10 goes to reset, pin 11 goes to 11, pin 12 to 12, pin 13 to 13, 5 volt to 5 volt and ground to ground. Next we connect the working Arduino with the USB to the computer. Go to Tools, Board and select the Chinese board that is not working. In my case it's an Arduino Uno. Next we go to Tools again, Programmer and select Arduino as ISP. Go to Tools again and select Burn Bootloader. Go back to Tools, Programmer and set back to Arduino ISP. Your clone should work just fine now. Arduino is great software and completely free to use. If you are buying Chinese copies of the Arduino controller, consider making a donation to support the Arduino software. Here's the link. Was this video helpful for you? Please click the like button and subscribe. See you in the next video.